Hello and welcome back to another misguided video. I am happy about this video because I finally got some fall pieces to try out with you guys. So we're going to go ahead and try these on, see what I think about them. If you are new here, hi, my name is Brenda. Thank you so much for joining us. And go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on more videos like these. Other than that, let's go ahead and get into the video. So the first thing that I'm going to be showing is this beautiful cami top that I got. It's in in like this washed out top color is it top or taupe something like that I don't know I have the tag right here I got it in a size 6 it's really pretty I love this little basic V that it's doing right here and then this cut out in the neck area it's just a basic little cami top and I went ahead and paired it with this really pretty um, red floral skirt and this one's from Shein so <laughs> this one actually came a little bit late so if you haven't seen my Shein video um, I went ahead and did a big old massive haul on Shein and this one actually didn't arrive in time so I didn't get to showcase it so I thought to pair it up with this little cute top it's a pretty basic top there's really not much to it it's a really stretchy material so I believe it is true to size um, there's really not much to say about it except it's cute, it's basic, and you can pair it up with different prints that you want since it is a solid basic top. And it does go right above, a little bit above my belly button, so it's an alright kind of top. This skirt obviously sits very high-waisted, but I just really like the color and the simple style that it has, so this is the very first one. So this is really good to wear, you know, during the fall and autumn time when it's a little bit fresher, but there's still some heat. So it's really thin, it's flowy, you could dress it up with a denim jacket if you like, a pair of heels, boots, sneakers. I feel like you could definitely dress this one up or down if you wanted to. So this next one is this really pretty super crop jumper. I got it in a size 6, 8. Those were the size references that it gave me. Um, I love it. It's so warm. It's definitely thick as that knitted material. I love the way it sits just right here. And then I just went ahead and paired it with some Zara mom jeans that I had. So I feel like this gives it a whole other look right here. Um, it's really warm. It's not extremely itchy, but it's not too, too soft either. I love this soft khaki nude color if you would like to call it that but yeah i thought this was definitely a very warm kind of outfit you could dress it up with some boots some sneakers some slippers if you want to be even more chill um but yeah i thought this was a really cute jumper so that is the back if i lift my hands up it does go up pretty high so if you don't want this effect to happen then you can definitely size up but i love the style and how it is exactly Okay, this next one I am so in love with. So it is this oversized shirt and the belt and the jeans. So first, it's this poplin oversized shirt. It's a collared shirt. It is so pretty. I have nothing like this in my wardrobe. Look at these sleeves, these puff sleeves. It's like a whole fashion vibe right here. Oh, and I also got this pretty little chain as well. It's in gold. Um, this one is in a size 8. It fits really nice. I had to obviously tuck it in. It's very oversized. Um, the belt is in gold. The only thing about the belt, it was too big for me. I actually don't remember what size I got the belt in, so I'll probably, you know, pop it up somewhere here. But it was too big, so I quickly literally jabbed a hole and, you know, to, so I could make it smaller. I'm not about to return it and get another smaller size. It wasn't that bad, so the button, the, I guess, the tie goes all the way here, the little buttons where you clasp it in. But I had to put it over here, so I just made a little hole for me. But the belt is super cute. This one's in gold, and I got a silver one as well. And yeah, so I thought this was really pretty. The back to this looks just like that. Sorry if it's a little bit wrinkled, but I didn't have time to, you know, be all perfect and iron it. But the sleeves, the sleeves are good. They're okay. This is how it would be if I went ahead and, you know, clasped it this way. This is the regular length to the sleeve. But I would definitely just wear it like this, which I just folded it over and I clasped it with a button. The print is really pretty. I love this whole vibe that it has. 
So now for the jeans. The jeans are super nice. I love these. I think these are going to be like my new favorite skinny black jeans. So these are called Sinner Authentic uh, skinny jeans and these are in a size 6. They're really pretty. It has this ripped hem all over this side of the leg and then this one just has it on the knee area. It's really cute. It fits true to size. Um, they are super stretchy. When I first got them and I saw it um, when I was holding them up like this, I, I don't know why, I don't know if anybody else does that. Let me know down in the comments below, but I have a tendency to hold my jeans up and I'm like, mm, I think it'll fit. So these actually look like they're going to be small, but once you put them on, they have so much stretch to them. I love this whole outfit. It gives me a very fall vibe, but definitely in a dressed up, trendy kind of way. Um, I could pair these up with some heels, some boots, some sneakers. It's like you could wear it in a different way. Let me know if you like this shirt, what you thought about it, or if you're like, oh, Brenda, that looks weird. But I really like it. I don't know why I'm doing this. Let me just tuck it out so you guys can see the actual length of the shirt. So this is the actual length. It's still pretty good length and you can wear it like this if you wanted to with some leggings if you wanted to dress it down or you can just go ahead and like do that half half up, half down, tucked in type of thing. I know there's a lot of words going on that I just said, but you know what I mean? Like you can do something like this, I guess. I don't know, does it look weird? Actually sort of doesn't. Once you turn around, you're like, oh, okay, there it goes. Sort of tucked in here. It's actually pretty cute. The material is not stretchy. It's like this stiff um, cotton kind of material. It's super thin. It's not stretchy at all, but it's really nice. I love the colors. This is definitely a fall look. Okay, this next one is this really pretty royal blue sweatshirt. It's really nice. It's a little basic sweatshirt um it's oversized obviously and i think i got this one in a size small and it just has the misguided graphic name right there it's really nice and i went ahead and just paired it up with the same skinny jeans that i got i got i thought this was going to be like you know it's a cute look it matches this too you can add some sneakers some trainers um some slippers if you want to just be all chill and everything but i thought this was cute i loved i like it when sweaters do this I don't know, maybe some other people don't like that, but, you know, obviously it fits good, but if you want to be all, like, you know, cozy and everything, you could just wear it like that. So I like the color. It's a bit of a pop color, but I still think it goes in with fall. You can even pair it up. I didn't say boots. Yes, you could pair it up with boots, too, but this is a really cute one. It's oversized. I feel like it fits true to size. Not too big, but not too small, either, and it goes right here on my lower bum area, and yeah. The material is like any other sweatshirt, I believe. It's soft. Um, it's not extremely soft like I would think in the inside, but it's it's pretty basic. I like it. Put it in. <laughs> it wasn't going in. Okay. Okay, so I think I accidentally got this in a tall. I'm assuming that means for taller people, right, when it says tall or just nothing and it says the name of it but it's a tall shacket okay not jacket it says a shacket it's really cute the color is in the color sage it is super pretty i love it i got it in a size eight i just went ahead and kept the black jeans the belt and i put on the top um cami that i showed in the very beginning i kept the necklace on this is a very cute jacket i like it it is super thick. It's really soft. I like the way it feels and obviously the colors. Yes, I was being difficult in, you know, putting it in, but you could take it off, obviously. The only reason this one is not popped back in is because my big old nails, I was having struggles and it's still hot where I'm at, so I am sweating up a storm up in here. But I am loving this and I will definitely be wearing this for winter when it ever gets to those chillier days. I got it in a size 8. I don't know if there was a size 6. I really don't know why I got it in a size 8. But, you know, it's really oversized but I don't mind it at all. It sort of fits me like a long jacket, you know, since I'm 5'2", I'm pretty short. It fits like an oversized, you know, one of those long jackets because it fits me all the way right here. If I would have gotten this shorter, I probably wouldn't have liked it because it doesn't really do much 
you know, and like a shape wise, it's pretty straight, but it looks like a long jacket. <laughs> it's really cute. If I were to button it up, it would just go right up here and then it'll still look pretty nice. It'd just be very open, but I think I'd rather have it as a, you know, oversized jacket type of style and wear it this way. I'm really not starting to like my nails, but <laughs> for the moment because I'm trying to put this on. This goes with this necklace as well. They're really cute. They're in the gold color and it's really thick. I'm just having the hardest time in my life trying to put them on because of my nails, but I really wanted to show y'all how it looked paired up with this outfit. So the next thing that I wanted to show y'all was this really cute um, printed coard shorts with the belt on it. It says belted shorts. So they're really pretty. They look like this. They're in a size 6, so they're true to size. And they are see-through. I can definitely see my undie through this. Um, but either way, it is true to size. You could wear a nude, thin, you know, thong with this or underwear. And I paired it with this white knitted top. This top is from Shein. It is knitted, so it's thick. It's a hot um, one-shoulder crop top. So I thought this together it would look super cute you can pair it with some heels i would say sandals you know since we do have this short if you wanted it to be more of a warmer kind of vibe you can put on a little jacket with this but i thought this set was really pretty these shorts have like these black lines going on around it and i know that this can also be paired with the blazer that comes with it obviously it doesn't come with it but it's separate um but there's a blazer that is exactly the same so if you wanted to you could put this and then that blazer it'd be a whole new style but obviously i didn't get it because that one was a little bit too much <laughs> But either way, I love the shorts. They're really pretty. They do not go above your booty. They're in a good length. It is true to size. There's still two buttons that I could have buttoned it up to, but I did it right here. So it does have a good amount of room, you know, for you. So you don't have to worry about that. It's a thin material. It is not stretchy. This one is not stretchy, but it is true to size. Oh, and I'm already taking it off, but I forgot to mention it has... A zipper to it so you can zip it down so it has that zipper for you right here so you can easily zip it up and down yourself I don't think you need help with this one this one that I have right here is a jersey short set um, it is in the color sage I believe is it like a sage or a green um, but they're really pretty the shorts to this one I love this so much one because it's in a size 6 and it is super super stretchy like Look at that. It's so stretchy, but not in a bad way where it's going to fall. It's just very loose and comfortable. You can wear this on those days like me, on those PMS days where you really don't want nothing nagging at your waist. These would be a good pair to wear because it's very loose and flowy. There's not a lot of cinching going on right here. And I love this little top that it comes with. I just thought that since it was fall, this was a pretty um, fall outfit you know to be wearing around the house if you wanted to but it's really cute there's not really much to it there's a lot of stretch i just loved the set and i had to get it so these very last two things that i got are these basic nude joggers and this really nice mint jumper it's that knitted material same as the one that i showed previously except this was in a tall so that's how you can see it's a little bit longer it is still in the size 6 8 it's just more longer for you right here in the torso area which I still don't mind it's just a little bit more looser so when I raise my hands up it won't show too much except when I do this you know you can still see it here but it's still definitely very loose very warm very thick um, the jumpers as well are really nice these are in a size 6 the only thing is that the waist area, it is very cinched. This is very cinched, so it's not loose like the, you know, short set that I showed. This is more cinched to the waist, but I feel like it gives me a pretty figure, so I really don't mind it. It's not a uncomfortable way, but if you don't like that and you don't want that to happen, you can definitely size up. They'll just be a little bit looser. I feel like these fit me fitted, but in a good way. Not extremely fitted, but I love the shape that it gives me. It's actually really pretty. These are in a size 6. Um, they have pockets right here, and they fit perfect on my ankle right here. And I paired it up with my Shein little cute nude 
slippers that I got. So if you want to go see that video, go check it out. But yeah, I really love this one. It's pretty basic. It's warm. It's cute. I feel like this is another fall one. You could take it out, go to the store, go somewhere to eat that's cozy with your family, your friends. You know, I really liked this one. Alrighty, everyone. So that is it for this misguided haul. I really do hope that you enjoyed the pieces as much as I did. I loved everything. I can't wait to wear them. And if you really did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more videos like these. Always let me know down in the comments below. I love talking to everyone that is watching me. I would like to know what videos you would like to see more of out of my channel. So just throw anything down out there and I'll see if I can make it happen for you guys. Other than that, thank you so much for watching and I will see you lovelies on the next one. Bye!